Hey everybody, this is week 33 of 2023. All timestamps will be in the description and we start off with the cigar of the week or the smoke of the week. This is the Tirano Dominico. Always like to turn the cigar to get an even torch. Wait until it's evenly gray all throughout. And we're off. So the Tirano family, they have a cigar pedigree that dates back to 1916. The uh, Dominico brings an aged blend of Dominican long filler tobaccos cloaked in a seamless Connecticut leaf grown in Ecuador. The smoke is mellow and smooth. There's a creamy core and it includes notes of cedar, oak, and nuts. So for those that don't know, Tobacco long filler refers to a type of tobacco that's used in the production of premium cigars. So it's considered to be the highest quality type of tobacco filler used in cigars. So why is that important? Because the long filler tobacco it consists of leaves that run the entire length of cigar. Well, why does that matter? Because the leaves are aged and they're fermented and that's what helps develop their flavors and remove any harshness. So the long filler is chosen for one, its ability to burn evenly, which is very important. And number two, to provide a complex and enjoyable smoking experience. It's rich in flavors. So in contrast, a short filler or mixed filler, that's the that cigars are often chopped or sh shredded, the tobacco leaves. It results in a less consistent burn. There's, there's a less kind of nuanced flavor profile. Um, compared to premium cigars that are made with long filler tobacco. Um, long filler cigars are often handmade and they're considered to be the pinnacle of cigar craftsmanship. All right, enough about cigars. My week in real estate. Monday night, we won our basketball game by a very wide margin of 100 to 29. So we are uh, definitely gonna be moving up to the next division next season. We play at the municipal courts in Balboa Park. They have leagues there that go Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Um, then I had a, on Tuesday, I had a really great discovery call with a referral that's uh, gonna be moving down from the Bay Area. You wouldn't believe it, but they're in tech, surprisingly, uh, which San Diego is, really has cultivated a lot of um, the Bay Area, Boston, New York, that demographic that are all in the life sciences, AI, tech, that are all coming down here. The job market has opened up in those industries and will continue to do so in the life sciences, especially with all of the development projects that are bringing in tens of thousands of high paying tech jobs. I had a new listing come to market this week that was down in Otai, new construction, townhome. Uh, it's a four bed, three bath, 1,700 square feet. I held that open Saturday and Sunday. Uh, we received a few offers, so the market is still hot i mean we were at we're priced at 669,000. all the offers were over market but at, at that price point if the home is staged well which it was the uh, market is still very high we actually there was another listing that was a model match that was listed approximately 700,000 less model match like same bed bath uh, square footage. It was a, a little bit of a different floor plan, but um, the fact that we still had offers when we were 70k above, and that's it's a decent percentage from 600 to, to 670, um, just also shows a testament of of how important it is to bring your home to market the right way. You only get one opportunity to make a first impression. So. The house was, the, the unit was very clean, it was staged very well, minimalistic, decluttered, and everyone that came in and toured it loved it because this other property that was on market was actually on the same street. So it was only a couple doors down. So everyone that came into my open house over the weekend obviously toured the model match next door and the reception for our listing was very high even though we were 70K uh, above the competitor. So the market is still hot. I have a market update that will be included in this weekly email. If you have any questions about buying, selling, or investing, um, love to hop on a quick call with you. We can chat here in San Diego. Until then, I'll see you next week.